Hey, what's up guys? Tony here from LearnAutoBodyAndPaint.com and man, is Tesla bombing and dropping the ball on paint jobs. Check this out. Tesla workers say factory paint job, paint shop has multiple fires. Check this out here. So much news on poor quality control, not just on the whole entire car itself, but the paint jobs. So this is factory finish. Check this out. It's having some issues in here. It looks like some biting in this area, you know, I don't know. Maybe they repaired it and just delivered it to the customer like that. I don't know, you know. Check out this uh, Tesla Motor Club forum where a customer received a brand new Tesla and he could basically see the, I don't know if they're using a gold base coat under it or it's just not painted. It doesn't look like it's covered well. This to me looks like there's just not enough paint on it. In here, you can see uh, along the hood line here by the T, below the T here, that it looks like simply there's not enough base coat on it. This is a brand new car, guys. Up in here, you really can't see too much on this image, uh, but here, especially around the hood and front fender here, you can see that. Even look at the trunk here, this whole top. This literally just looks like the machines are not spraying uh, enough base coat on the car here. Here's another shot. Pretty crazy if you ask me. You know, Elon Musk is saying that, hey, we do have a bottleneck with these paint jobs on all, all of our Model 3 Teslas, especially the Model 3. I'm not sure why, maybe it's a separate factory. Here's another article on issues with paint. And check this out. So here's what a $7,000 of car damage looks like. And I read through this article and I just wanted to show you the images. So this is the dent, okay? This dent costs $7,000 in body and paint to repair. Pretty ridiculous if you ask me. Uh, here is the quote, basically body and labor, uh, 30 hours at $125 an hour, comes out to 3,800 bucks. Paint labor, 13 hours at 125, 1600 and paint supplies, $34 at 13 hours, 448, $448. Sales tax, 500 bucks, $6,700 to repair this dent here. Why? Because they say, well, because it's a candy, I think it's a candy color, and they had to blend it into the front bumper cover and the door, but still, that is a lot of money for a little dent like that. Um, you know, and the metal is an aluminum, it's an aluminum steel. I think it's it's part aluminum, but not 100% aluminum. But still, I've fixed many aluminum hoods, Nissan 300ZXs, uh, and no issues. I mean, you could tap out aluminum, no problem. You could even weld aluminum with the aluminum pins and still pop out dents. Well, they got it fixed, and you can see that it looks brand new again. But still, 6700 bucks for a dent is a lot of money. And part of that job uh, was that they had to remove the back seats and disconnect the battery. Unbelievable, unbelievable. Um, here is another image of a bad paint job. So you can see that factory finish here, you got some, looks like they're using candy paint on the red. <clears throat> and we do have a, a drip here on the edge, the high edge. <clears throat> and um, looks like they tried to sand it and buff it out. Um, also, they're not even painting. I mean, usually you get some overlap and overspray around the areas underneath and around the, the uh, underside of the car. Looks like it hasn't even been painted here. You got some parts that are looks like have been sanded off but not refinished in this area here. Let me see if I could blow up these images for you. I know it's going to be a little unclear. Um, pretty crazy if you ask me. And if we check out this video here, you can see that the orange peel on the paint jobs are very, very bad. It kind of looks like they tried water sanding it and buffing it down, but it still doesn't look good at all if you check that out. So anyway, I uh, just wanted to share this with you on Tesla paint jobs, you know, not very good at all. A lot of complaints if you check out the forums. You know, it's not just a few cars. It's it's a lot of cars. 
Tesla, you need to start working on your quality control, especially with the paint, because I mean, who would want to get a brand new car and have not enough paint on a car looking like this? You know, it's all clouded up, not enough base coat, um, even in the door jam here. I mean, dude, this is very, very poor quality. Orange peel like crazy, you know, and um, it is what it is. I just wanted to share this article with you in video. Hope you're having a great New Year's. It's 2019. If you guys want to learn auto body and paint, check out learnautobodyandpaint.com to get your free 85-page booklet. Click right over here on the left top on mobile or down below if you're on desktop here. Let me know what you think. You know, Let me know. Comment below. Let me know what you think about this video. Talk to you soon. Have a great day. Bye.